Hey learners, Pranish Verma this side. Welcome to my channel guys. In today's YouTube session, we are going to learn speech and natural language processing, multiple choice question and answer and this is a very requested video for you guys. Now let's begin. In this, your first question is, what is the field of natural language processing? NLP. NLP stands for natural language processing. Options are option A. Computer Science, Option B, Artificial Intelligence, Option C, Linguistics, Option D, all of the mention. Right answer is Option D, all of the mention. Okay, so Computer Science is the field of NLP as well as AI is the field of NLP and Linguistics is also the field of Natural Language Processing. Okay, next question. NLP is concerned with the interactions between computers and human na natural language. Is true or false? Is true. Okay. Because NLP has its focus on understanding the human spoken written language and converts that interpretation into machine understandable language. Okay. Next question. What is the main challenge of NLP? Option A. Handling ambiguity of sentence. Option B. Handling tokenization. Option C. Handling pause tagging. Option D. All of them mentioned. Right answer is option A. Handling ambiguity of sentence. Okay, so handling ambiguity of sentence is a main challenge of NLP. Natural language pro processing. Okay, because there are enormous ambiguity exist when processing natural language. Okay, next question. Next question is modern NLP algorithms are based on machine learning, especially statistical machine learning. Is true or false? Is true. Okay, next question. Choose from the following areas where NLP can be useful. Option A, automatic text summarization. Option B, automatic question answering system. Option C, information retrieval. Option D, all of the mentioned. Right answer is option D, all of the mentioned. Okay, so NLP can be useful in automatic text summarization and in automatic question answering system. And information retrieval also. Okay. Next question. Which of the following includes major tasks of NLP? Option A. Automatic summarization. Option B. Discourse analysis. Option C. Machine translation. Option D. All of the mentioned. Right answer is option D. All of the mentioned. Okay. So, major tasks of NLP are automatic summarization, discourse analysis and machine translation. Okay, so there is an even bigger list of tasks of NLP. Okay, next question. What is coherence resolution? Option A, anaphora resolution. Option B, given a sentence or large chunk of text to determine and or large chunk of text to determine which words mentions refer to the same object means entities and option C all of them mentioned option D none of them mentioned right answer is option B given a sentence or large chunk of text determines which words mentions refers to the same object means entities okay so right answer is option B next question what is machine translation? Option A. Convert one human language to another. Option B. Convert human language to machine language. Option C. Converts any human language to English. Option D. Converts machine language to human language. Right answer is option A. Converts one human language to another. Okay. So machine translation is converts one human language to another language. Okay. The best known example of machine translation is your Google Translator. Okay. This is the question. What is the example of machine translator? So, example of machine translator is Google Translator. 
The more general task of conference resolution also includes identifying so-called bridging relationship involving referring expressions is true or false is true. Next question. What is morphological segmentation? Option A. Dose discourse analysis. Option B. Separate words into individual morphemes and identify the class of the morphemes. Option C. Is an extension of propositional logic. Option D. None of the mentioned. Right answer is option B. Separate words into individual morphemes and identify the class of the morphemes. Okay. Next question. Given a stream of text named entity recognition determines which pronoun map to which noun is false or true is false. Okay. Because given a stream of text named entity recognition determines which items in the text map to proper names. Okay. Next question. Natural language generation is the main task of natural language processing. Is true or false? Is true. Because natural language generation is to convert information from computer database into readable human language. Okay. Next question. OCR means optical character recognition uses NLP. Is true or false? Is true. Because given an image representing printed text, it determines the corresponding text. Okay. Next question. Parts of a speech tagging determines option A. Part of a speech for each word dynamically as per meaning of the sentence. Option B. Part of a speech for each dynamically as per sentence structure. Option C. All part of a speech for a specific word given as input. Option D. All of the mentioned. Right answer is option D. All of the mentioned. Okay. So parts of a speech tagging determines. First one part of a speech for each word dynamically as per meaning of the sentence. Second one part of a speech of each word dynamically as per sentence structure. And third one all part of a speech for a specific word given as input. Okay. Because a Bison network provides a complete description of the domain. Okay. Next question. Parsing determines parse tree means grammatical analysis for a given sentence is true or false is true. Because determine the parse tree grammatical analysis of a given sentence. The grammar for natural language is ambitious and typical sentence have multiple possible analysis. In fact, perhaps surprise. Surprisingly, for a typical sentence, there may be thousands of potential parser, most of which will seem completely non-essential to human. Okay, next question. IR, information retrieval and IE, information extraction are two same thing. Is true or false? Is false. Because information retrieval this is concerned with storing, searching and retrieving information. It is a separate field within computer science closer to database. But I release on some NLP methods, for example, steaming. Some current research and application seek to bridge the gap between IR and NLP. Okay. And information extraction means IE. This is concerned in general with the extraction of semantic information from text. This covers tasks such as named, entity recognition, conference resolution, relationship extraction, etc. Okay. Next question. Many words have more than one meaning. We have to select the meaning which make the most sense in context. This can be resolved by option A. Fuzzy logic. Option B. Bird sense. Disambiguation. Option C. Shallow semantic analysis. Option D. All of them mentioned. Right answer is option B. Word says disambiguation because shallow semantic analysis doesn't cover word says.
दिस एम्बिगेशन ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन गिवन ए साउंड क्लिप ऑफ ए पर्सन और पीपल स्पीकिंग डिटरमाइन द टेक्सटल रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ द स्पीच ऑप्शन ए इज टेक्स्ट टू स्पीच ऑप्शन बी इज स्पीच टू टेक्स्ट ऑप्शन सी ऑल ऑफ द मेंशनड एंड ऑप्शन डी नॉन ऑफ द मेंशनड राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी स्पीच ऑफ टेक्स्ट NLP is required to linguistic analysis okay next question a speech segmentation is a sub task of speech recognition is true or false is true okay next question in linguistic morphology blank space is the process of reducing inflected words to their root form option a rooting option b stemming Option C, text proofing. Option D, both rooting and steaming. Right answer is option B, steaming. In linguistic morphology, steaming is the process for reducing inflected words to their root root form. Okay, guys. Now let's wind up this lecture. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching this video. Wish you a very very all the best for your examination. Please subscribe to my channel for more updates. Thank you.